this this project involved the overall um, demolition and remediation of the entire uh, fertilizer site that was built back in the 60s. As far as the stack or chimney was concerned, one of our biggest considerations was, apart from cost, was the issue about um, safety of residents and also in terms of time. Um, so it, was, it presented a unique challenge for us to try to uh, bring down the stack in a, the most cost efficient, but at the same time most environmentally and safe a way of doing so. Uh, we, had, we had some very good learnings during the planning stage in which we were trying to understand the structure of this stack, also the surroundings and what kind of risks are involved in that. The extent of coordination required between ORECA, CCM, the contractor various and caliber and the level of support required from the government bodies. So I think these were the key learnings during our uh, preparation stage. So all things being considered, to be quite honest, I was quite sceptical at the beginning. Uh, but when I was first approached about the possibility of doing a controlled demolition, um, but I think in retrospect, it was the best decision we made, uh, especially after getting feedback from the local residents, some of whom did not even realise that we actually had demolished the stack. Orica used packaged explosive and to initiate them, they use the electronic detonators in a 450 mm holes. The precision and control was the key thing in delivering this job. So therefore, we selected unitronic detonators to provide electronic signals to fire the explosive. And the best part of this technology was that uh, each and every detonator can be tested beforehand, uh, before firing the shot. Uh, what Orica brought was a very high uh, sense of safety in terms of both pre-planning uh, and during the actual execution of the demolition. I think it was the first time that there's something such as this has been done in Malaysia and um, there were a lot of firsts that we had to encounter. The team were, uh, from Orica uh, were great in terms of interfacing with the regulatory authorities and also, more importantly, also interfacing with the residents that surrounded the site. Orica brings in, onto the table world-class standards in terms of the management of uh, blasting technology. And I think um, it's, it's, there are always inherent risks in most products that you sell, but more so when you uh, manage a business like this. So to me, it's always about the safety standards that the partner brings to the table. Uh, that we uh, in CCM we, uh, would actually uh, subscribe to as well. So compared to the alternative, which would have been to remove it floor by floor, section by section, could have taken us up to three months and therefore the dust we would have generated during that period would have highly inconvenienced. Um, so this was unique, but I think it was the right thing to do, uh, taking all things into consideration. The stack collapse actually happened on exactly on the tra trajectory which was planned, uh, hitting the abandoned car which was kept as a target. So that told about the precision of the job. Other than that, uh, we also saw no dust and no fly rocks during the event, uh, which was a great outcome. For most civil contractors who are doing site remediation work, it should definitely be a tool that you should consider. Uh, it's cost effective, it's safe, and probably um, more importantly, I think you actually save a lot of time. And I think Orica CCM Energy Systems is the only company in Malaysia that actually has the technology that it can bring forth to a project such, such as this.